Hi, Fire Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you guys your uh, weeklies for this coming week of March 31st uh, to April 6, 2024. Please keep in touch, and please keep in mind that this is a general reading, um, meaning that if you are interested in your own private reading, all that information is down below in the description box below. So we're going to start off first for the sign of Leo. 28 we'll put 28 seconds for leo hello leo this is a 15 card spread for you guys i basically heard i just waited long enough kind of thing i'm frustrated i'm done and taking that next step spirits kind of encouraging you not to move forward okay this person is going to come back. They're going to be balanced with that King of Pentacles. Earth sign energy does not have to be, but they're looking for completion and they are going to be coming back pretty fast, I feel, with the Seven of Wands and underneath is the Eight of Wands there. So out of the blue, I feel this person is coming on back here to explain things, definitely. I feel that they kind of scurried. They kind of left in a hurry. They got up in their head, definitely, with that Eight of Wands and Eight of Swords, I'm sorry, energy. And I feel like they're making a plan in their head to strategize how to get you back. They are no longer confused. They are really working on their energy here. There is a decision of you showing the action back if need be. Uh, but yeah, I feel that, you know, so everything can be settled here. You're going to kind of, they're going to be coming back so fast, wanting, demanding, sorry for that strong word, for your attention, for your love, for your obligation, for your answer. To take them back here, but I feel the main message here is Spirit is saying, don't leave, okay? Don't leave. This is not done. This is not resolved yet. There's more to this story here. You're just so fed up, but once you hear their voice, you're going to kind of crumble, okay? Definitely. They're going to be coming back. You want answers. They're going to communicate to you these answers and everything will be settled with the Empress energy. She's very balanced. It's a twin flame for sure here. And you do love them, but you're just tired of the frustration of it all. So let's do the above and below here for Leo, which is uh, the Fool, the King of Pentacles, and the Seven of Pentacles. This tells me, give this some more time. They are working on their energy. They're going to come back, bounce back. I literally heard uh, balance here in this relationship. They want you back. They got up in their head, but they are going to be making a decision in regards to this relationship with the higher font, the Ten of Cups, and the Seven of Cups present. With the Seven of Wands, the Ace of Wands, and the uh, Queen of Wands here. So it's going to be a little frustrating to hear from them. They're going to be kind of like, uh, tell me now, you know, kind of energy here. And you're, kind of, you're going to be like, look, I'll answer at my own pace. Thank you very little, you know. Uh, things are going to improve for sure, but, you know, there's a lot of explaining that needs to be straightened out first, and I do feel that they will apply to that in regards to explaining things with the Three of Wands and making things right again, Eight of Swords and Knight of Wands. With the Four of Wands, the Eight of Wands, and the Four of Swords, they're going to be taking that next step pretty quickly here to settle your mind, to explain things, to communicate, to let it be known what happened, you know, exactly what happened you know in regards to the ghosting thing they could put a little bit of pressure on you to take them back but i do feel regardless there's tears of joy tears of happiness the stagnation is done uh they are going to explain things you're going to want to know absolutely but it will calm your mind and bring back that love back into this relationship not that you ever lost it i feel uh, especially with that Queen of Cups, water sign energy does not have to be. So that is what I have for the sign of Leo. Moving on to Aries. Aries is four, 414 we'll put for Aries. Hope you guys are doing well. This is going to be a 15 card spread with outcome and clarifier. Ooh. Somebody's large and in charge, I heard, literally. The past is that they walked away from you. You reflect on that, them walking away and how disappointing it is. But they have plans to return here. Out of the blue, again, I feel with that knight of swords wanting an answer, giving you an option of whether or not you want them back or not. They really are going to give it a try here to be successful of movement again in this. But they're not really sure because, and you're not really sure 
because you're worried about a repeat offense here. If they're going to leave you again kind of thing. Now, for some, they're going to be successful with actually driving, um, meeting you. Okay, surprise visit, I feel, with that Knight of Swords again. But they're willing to give this a try, a shot, even though they're not really sure whether or not they can get you back here. There's going to be good old communication. They come in with, uh, I literally heard gifts. So there could be a gift. <coughs> Getting what they want, which is you. This is a wish fulfillment. I feel for majority of you, they'd rather talk to you in person as well. But definitely out of the blue energy, not expecting this. But this is a twin flame I'm feeling with that high priestess. Sorry for the cough. They don't want to fight with you. They do miss you. They do regret their past actions, and they are sorry with that Page of Cups energy. So let's do the above and below here. You have the Two of Pentacles, the Three of Cups, and the Two of Swords. So I feel for someone out there, they're going to make jokes, okay? They're going to lighten the mood, I, as you well know me uh, by now. If you have not, anybody that comes in with a joke and you're on my out list, uh, you're back in. <laughs> so I'm easily humored, I guess you'd say, but definitely there's a decision by their words, by their communication skills to you if you want to accept this happiness back into your life again, knowing them, uh, meeting them, I mean. The Knight of Swords, the Six of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles, they're ready to conquer. They're ready to be victorious to bring back total balance here. They got the oomph I feel to move with this relationship. You are their wish fulfillment here. They could be coming and visiting you with the King of Wands. Uh, that could be a make makeup session as well. You know, in-person makeup session, the Chariot and the Nine of Cups. I don't feel that they're using you for anybody who was questioning that with that. Okay, I felt like somebody was, but I don't feel that they would use you like a one night stand kind of thing. I don't feel it's that. I just feel it's part of the makeup session. The Eight of Cups, the Five of Swords, and the Moon, they got up in their head. They walked away. They got scared. They got paranoid, what have you. The Queen of Pentacles, the Six of Pentacles, and the High Priestess, I feel that somebody needed to turn to Source. Good for you to kind of calm your energy, give to not just Source, but your own energy to heal yourself as well. And it's definitely divinely guided here. I know our favorite expression. But you put that work in, and now it is time for them to return, they don't want to fight with you. They want to make things right with the sun. Are they worried that there's going to be a fight? Yes, okay. They don't have a lot of confidence in getting you back, but they are going to be coming back, communicating, offering that cup of love and an apology as well needed. So with that page of cups energy. And that's what I have for the sign of Aries. Moving on to Sagittarius. Let's find out the time for Sag. 808 we'll put here for Sag, 15 card spread. Hope you guys are doing well. Could be dealing with earth sign energy. They do miss you here, they're balanced, they know exactly what they want. They're coming in full steam ahead. They're not even questioning, they're not even second guessing. They're gonna have a little bit of fear, but I feel that fear is that you're still hurt, you know, and, and they're worried that you're going to cut them out, especially with that queen of swords. She is air sign energy, but it's really about, she's the cutout queen. It's like, nope, you've had your time, son. You know, um, I'm done with you kind of thing. They they know that they've been extremely slow with two nights in a row with the knight of cups and knight of pentacles, but they're willing to have this chance to have a change, to offer this apology, to get you back, to get past the stagnation of it all with that hangman. Like I said, it's going to be coming in pretty quickly. You're not going to see this. It's going to be so confusing with the Seven of Cups right after that Queen of Wands here. That's your energy, or you could be dealing with another fire sign here. But regardless, you don't know what to do. You don't know what to pick. You don't know if you should accept them back into your life again. But there is this opportunity, if spoken, if communication uh, comes in strong, you know, and we listen, we all listen to each other here kind of thing. You can receive that cup of love, but you may need some time to think about things for sure. But I do feel that you will at least hear them out and eventually come around, I feel, because it's a trust issue. Once you get burned, it's hard to bounce back, you know. So definitely, if you need to, it's not going to resonate for everybody. But if you need to, think about it before showing that action of that completion of love. 
with the Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, and Ten of Cups here. So let's do the above and below here for Sag. You got the King of Pentacles, Earth Sign, Energy, Knight of Cups, and Eight of Wands. After such a long time, they worked on their energy, but they're coming in way faster uh, than need to, okay, for sure. Uh, I feel like they're eager, but they're a little nervous of your answer here, and they miss you here, but it's been such a long time, but be ready. You're going to have to show that action here, but it's going to confuse you like nothing uh, in this world. Three of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. Having that inner strength to have this change, but, you know, they're not really sure if you're going to accept them back here. Strength card, Death card, and the Seven of Cups. With the Tower, the Page of Pentacles, and the Eight of Swords, it's going to be overwhelming how fast they do come in, even more so with that Eight of Wands energy with an apology, with communication, with bounce being brought in, and it's going to kind of make your mind spin. So definitely, I feel that some are going to hear them out here, where others are just going to move forward again in their life. It's split, okay, definitely. But at least there's communication. I feel for majority of you, you can get past the stagnation, communicate, and lead to taking to that next step. But for others, being the outcome, being the way it is, with the Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, Ten of Cups, this tells me you're going to have to think about it. It's really going to slam you, you know, really going to confuse you, really going to take you into shock here. So if you need that extra time to kind of clear your head, do so before showing the action and accepting their completion of love here with that Ten of Cups energy. And that's what I have for not just Sag, but for all the fire signs out there. Thank you all for watching. I do appreciate it as always. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also smash that like button and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.